Your Majesty, this is the final product from the rubber trees you have in your kingdom. The ones you are after. Well, uh, Your Majesty, yes, that's correct. And what is that? This is a portrait of our gracious queen, Queen Victoria. Hmm. Hmm. You say this is your queen, your ruler? Yes, your majesty. What does her husband do when she is ruler over your people? <laughs> well, unfortunately, your majesty, the husband is dead. Oh. My condolence. Thank you. Thank you. But I'm curious. Is it that there is no man in the whole of Britain to sit on the throne of his fathers? That his wife has to be your ruler? Well, your majesty, in our tradition... Never mind. Is that all? Well, uh, no, Your Majesty. There's, uh, there's this important document. This contains the articles of understanding that you must sign to enable the activation of British protection of your kingdom. Is that all that is in the document? Well, Your Majesty, if you will allow, I will read it to your hearing. Article 1. Her Majesty, the Queen of Great Britain and Ireland, Empress of India, in compliance with the request of the King of Benin, hereby undertakes to extend to him and to the territory under his authority and jurisdiction her gracious favour and protection. Stop! Go no further. For 400 years, Galloway, my fathers before me traded and dealt with a white man. 400 years. The French, the Portuguese, the Dutch. But, uh... I am not impressed. Your queen seems so fervent about destinations. Forgetting that only a journey will take her there. I'm not happy! He said. I may understand, Your Majesty. If the very first article in your treaty is based on false claim, I need no oracle to tell me what the end will be. But, Your Majesty, this is standard practice in all treaties. If it is standard practice for you to lie, I will none of it! Yes, to think that I nearly put my mark on that document. But, Your Majesty, the protection of Great Britain will be of immense value to you and your people. Look at me. What do you see? I am spirit! Eh, mini, mini, mini! Spirits don't need protection. Spirits protect others. If I must trade with a white man, we must do it as equals. He 